My name is Dr. Christine Sint, and I'm a professor of clinical ophthalmology at the University of Iowa. I have been at the university about 28 years, and my practice is pretty much sick or diseased eyes, specifically keratoconus, corneal transplants, and infants. Keratoconus is a condition where the cornea develops a bump and as light comes through, it can't focus on the retina, which is the seeing part of the eye. And if the light can't focus, we get a very blurry image. I will say keratoconus found me. It was not something I set out to find, but it seemed that there were so many people with this disease and so few people studying it, so few people being able to treat it, that it seemed like a natural progression for me within this department to pick that up as my specific area of study. The most important thing for me is I want patients to know that they are connected with a group of people that are willing to stick it there with them and make their life better. An eye is not round. And when you have a disease like keratoconus, it has a cone on it, so there's a bump on the eye. And fitting a round contact, which is what is available on the market, fitting a round contact lens on a bumpy eye is not okay. And the contact lenses were sliding off, they were uncomfortable, they would decenter, they would dislocate out of the patient's eye. And then I wasn't able to put all the optics on them that they needed. And rather than saying, this is terrible, too bad. I said, well, let's do something about this. So I developed a way that we could take an impression of the eye. I've developed a way that we can scan the surface of the eye to create 3D models of all these bumps that people have. And then we created a, a way to fit a contact lens to over all of those bumps on the surface of a patient's eye. So we've been able to create a contact lens that I can then put advanced optics on. I can correct not just regular powers in astigmatism, but I could also do higher order optics. I can do multifocals. I can do prism in any direction because of the stability. So sometimes actually all of these bumps help lock in that contact lens, which actually make it able to do a smart contact lens. The University of Iowa is this incredibly growing place with these specialists that come in and we all interact and we talk and we grow each other within the department. And so Iowa has uniquely positioned itself with our cornea service, with the contact lens service to become an expert in the treatment of keratoconus. I love working in an academic medical center. It's not just a medical center that I work at. I work at a whole university and all of these people are the top in their field and they're excited and they're passionate about their sub area. So when I have a question about chemistry, I have literally gone over to the chemistry department and talked to their professors, talked to their graduate students to educate myself on what I need to know. When I have questions about ocular shape, I actually went to dentistry and educated myself on dental shape and how they gather those images and what their understanding is. There's so many people at this university that are just so passionate and they're also teachers and they wanna teach and they wanna teach other passionate people. So connection really is what puts medicine forward. Connection is what makes us better.